I was getting a lot of requests from many of you to make a quick overview tutorial so you guys can have an idea that what exactly you're going to build in this particular course. So this is the entire NFT marketplace, pro NFT marketplace we're going to build in the course. So the very first component we have in our marketplace is the header section. This is the logo and from here you can able to control the theme of your application. So we have two themes, light and dark mode. You can click and you can turn it off. That's how it's going to look on the light mode, pretty beautiful. But my favorite is the dark mode. So you can go and from here you can able to go to different pages, my account, offer and create. So this is the hero section we have. You can put your email, name and submit and you will send the email to the marketplace owner. Then we have the second component. From here you can able to filter the NFT. For example, if I want to have a recent NFC, recently added. So you can see I'm already there recently added. If I click here, if I go with the low to high price, I can click here and the price is exactly the same. You can see all the NFT has the same pricing. That's why you cannot able to see the changes in the pricing. Then if I go to the high to low, here it's changed. So the highest price of an NFT is 25 ETH and it changed because most of the NFT has the 12 price. So that's how you can easily able to filter the NFT. Even you can search if I type NFT gift, okay, NFT gift and I can able to filter the NFT and you can click and have a detail. So that's how the second component would look like, like you can able to filter based on the price and search. If I come back here, here we have the audio section. Here you will find all the NFT related to the audio category. So from here you can able to have a control. You can download and you can play. So let me play that for you. You can play this one. Looks pretty fine. And now the third section we have is the video category. So from here you can able to play the video. Like you can play right up here and you can watch. You can make on the big screens to have a good idea that how it's going to look like. And if you can, you will it will take you to the NFT details page and you will have all the information about the NFT. So right now I'm the owner of this NFT so I can set this NFT for an auction. So that's why I'm getting this button set for an auction. Okay, come back. We're going to explore each one of this one by one. So that's the audio and this is the video and now we have the creator so here you will find list of all the nft creator which they have created their nft in our marketplace and here we are displaying our brand now we have this banner component and here we are promoting our app so if we have our app on play store or apple we can simply go and download that then we have the footer section user can put their name so if i put and i can click on the submit it's going to send an email so thanks for submitting so that's looks pretty good now what we can do is and here we have different pages as i told you that this is one of the biggest nft pro nft marketplace we go to build as an industry ready so we have a lot of pages so we have already seen the home page if i click on this audio it will take me to the audio page and you will see all the audios created in our platform so you can able to monitor all the audios if you go back to the video here you will find listed all the videos so we have a different categories which we have divided our nft then we have the images here you will find all the images listed in the nft marketplace for an auction and for sale that's all i will show you then we have the creator here you will find all the creators who have created nft with their worth of value of nft they hold then we have the charity and if you click here here you will find that how much fun you have received Till now for this charity user can simply come and they can give the charity to the platform so if i want to give charity something like that i can say charity and i can simply transfer the fund so here i have to change the button name charity not buy token and here you can explain about the project that why you are receiving the charity it's pretty beautiful so this is the charity we have received now we have then we have this offer click here and here you will find that what are the services you are offering to your user in this particular marketplace so first thing we have is the auction feedback token sale transfer fund and community so if you click on this nft auction you will find all the nft listed for an auction so you can pick and you can give the bidding you can able to find that it's listed in different category. Then if we go back here, we have the feedback. Here you can able to send the feedback to the admin of this marketplace and give your suggestion and report your problem which you are facing. And that is going to be a private message. Then we have the token sell. You can literally buy the token, the native token, which you can use in this platform to buy the NFT, which I will show you. So here you will find the details like token name, symbol, total supply, number of holders, your balance, and you can see the token address. 
the token price the number of tokens sold and the total number of token left for sell so you can literally buy the token and you can explain about the token that what its purpose and where the user can utilize that one let's go back here and here they have the transfer fund so they can easily be able to transfer the fund to anybody in this particular platform so they have to provide the amount address name and they can give the short description that why they are transferring the fund then we have let's go back here and here we have community here you will find all the user have joined the community to become a friend with one another so right now we have this three user who register themselves and you can easily be able to chat with them which i will explain you so we have seen the offer this is the offer we have seen the community we have seen the support we have seen the transfer and we have seen the ico and we have already seen the nft auction so all of this looks pretty fine these are the services we are providing now we have the support so if you click on this help center and here you can answer the question of your users so they can click and they can know that how they can utilize this nft marketplace how they can contact you all of those details and here we are promoting our application then we have this account my account page i will show you then let's come back to the contact us so this is the contact us page user can put information they can contact you then we have the about us so here you can explain about this nft marketplace your team and why you have launched this particular project we have seen so many things before i take you to the account page and show you that how it's going to look i want to take you here and i want to take you to the home page and let's talk about the detailed page of this nft marketplace so if you click here this particular nft it will take you to this detailed page and you can see that you can able to find all the information about this particular nft which is listed here the description category token and the price so you have this two option to buy this particular nft you can buy with the native token or you can buy with the ether price so if i come back here in the ico i already have this token in my account because i am the owner so i can purchase this nft using the native token or you can buy the nft using this native currency so click on this buy for 12 it's going to open this pop-up model and here you have to confirm the checkout so click on this checkout and it's going to make the transaction so simply click on confirm and here the transaction is completed and it will take you automatically to your account page so let's start working around this account page so this is how it's going to look so we have multiple cards multiple components multiple tabs which you can click and you can navigate to different component so this is where you will find all the nft which you own so you can see by default it's my nft if i click on that i can easily able to release this nft to the marketplace so i can click here i can give the price i'll say 40 56 i can k listed nft and i can say confirm and here the transaction went through and i have listed that nft to the marketplace so if i click here this is the one which i have listed even i can set this nft for an auction so if i click on the set nft i can give the starting price that how i want my price to be start so i want to start with 35 i want to start with 35 and i want to pick a date so i can give a one week period whatever period you want to give so you can go with that and click on this set auction and click on this confirm so you have successfully created your auctions now you can see the nft earlier you had three but now you have two because two nft you own now if you come back to the listed nft here you will find all the nft you have listed into this marketplace so this is all the image nft then we have the audio nft we have listed then we have the video nft we have listed and this is the one we have just now listed for creating a auction so if i click on here you can able to find the details about this nft so if i reload right now you can see no one has bid in this particular nft and i cannot able to see the auction input because i'm the owner and there is a six days auction is going to be end so this looks pretty fine now if i come back here and that's the we have seen the my nft we have seen the listed nft and now let's talk about the listed auction so if i click here here you will find all the nft which i have listed for an auction so you can easily able to do the filtration 10 and here i can filter that so you can filter nft or you can simply do the filtration based on the pricing so you can see low to high or maybe high to low it's totally up to you so all the nft has the same price that's why you cannot see there is no changes but it looks pretty fine so that's called our listed auctions all the nft we have listed for an auction now we have the image nft so all the image nft listed here in the marketplace that's all you will find here as well then we have the audio nft 
that's how it's going to look you can simply click and you can simply play fast and forward or you can simply delete or not delete <laughs> or you can download then we have the video here you can able to monitor and you can able to filter the nfts that's the video then we have the transfer all the transfer you have done the amount and the description you have given now you will find the friend so right now i'm friend with three users i can able to chat with any one of them so let me i'll show you just wait then we have the feedback here you will find all the feedback we have given to this marketplace and complain to the admin and here you will find that withdrawal bit so like in how many nft you have bid in so currently from this particular address i have bid in only one nft that's 23 and once the auction period is over i will get a if i not win the auction i will have a button which will say withdraw and i can click on this button and it's going to withdraw the fund which i have provided in the auction but if i won the nft i can simply complete the auction and i can i can claim the nft so that's the withdrawal one so it looks pretty good everything's looking pretty fine that's the bidding component now let's come back to the friend and here you will find the list of all the friend which you are in this community marketplace so right now i'm friend with sonal sahir and shwabhai so i can click on this sahir and it will take me to the chat page and here i can able to find all the chats which i have done with this user so right now i'm in the sahil i can easily able to send the message i'll say hey and i can simply send the message it's going to open this pop-up model and I can make the transaction. So this transaction is happening in real time. When the user will be on the other side, he can receive the message straight away. And he can go back to the Sonal and I can see that I have done this chat with Sonal. I can go with the swap by. I haven't done any chat. So I can simply send the message. I can say, hey, bye. And I can simply send the transaction and confirm. And the transaction is done and you can able to see the information so you can come back here and you can go back to the friend and literally you can select anyone so the moment you will select this show by it's going to open the show my context and you can able to find the details about the chat you have done that's how the chat would look like now let's come back to the create nft that how we can create that so click here and here you will have this entire create page where you can give out all the information about the nft which you want to create you can take as many data as you want once you complete this entire course you will have a, every single idea that how you have to add more data into your nft and take more details okay so first thing you have to do is you have to select the category so if i want to deploy video audio or image i can simply select the category so if i want to deploy this something like this video i can come back here I can click here and I can select the video which I want to deploy. So for example, I want to deploy this particular course video. So it's a two minutes video. So it will take a little bit of time. So just wait. And once it will deploy, you're going to have a video right up here. So the video is still deploying because it's a huge file. And here, finally, we got the video back. You can have a control. You can see, you can play the video and you can see what you have exactly in this video. You can play that. Or from here you can mute you have the control you can make it the full screen and you can even download that then you can easily give the name so I'll say video you can give the description whatever you want so I'll come back here and I'm going to simply get the text from here and I can simply paste here so we are done with that and here you have to provide this two price one price is for the ether so I'll go with the 25 and the second price you have to give for the token the nft marketplace native token so i want to sell this nft based on the same pricing 25 or you can say 21 whatever you want so i want to set the pricing for the both because my one token price is equal to one ether so that's that's the ratio i'm following you can literally give any price now i'm going to simply click on this create but before i do that i want to show you something so if i for example if i remove this name i have not provided the name but we need the name for creating the nft so if i click on this create item it's going to throw out this error message that you have to provide all the details so let me give the name i'll say video now i can simply come back here and i can call this create item and it's going to open the pop-up model and i can make the transaction and i can create the nft click on this confirm so that's the nft i have created if i come back here go to the listed one and i can see the pricing so this is the one i have created just now i can easily able to set this for an auction so that one is also looking pretty fine hope you guys have got an idea that how things are coming together so you can set the auction as well and you can set the create as many nft as you want 
and I'm the owner of this marketplace so I can simply able to monitor every single transaction which is taking place in our marketplace so if I go back to the admin panel and here I can able to control the transaction so this is the default component we're going to open and only admin only on of the contract have the access of this admin panel so from here they can easily able to send the email to anybody here he will find the stats so number of nft number of auctions created community feedback transfer donor total user the top recent user who created the nft and you will find the details of the nfts so with the pricing category addresses token id and you can click here and you can able to find the information about the nft then we have the number of user who have created the nft if i come back here to the nft here you will find the nft based on the category we have image video audio you can see we have divided this entire one so this looks pretty fine and you can click and you can watch the video if you come back to the community that's how the community would look like if you come back to the charity this is where you will find all the charity user have done in this marketplace then we have the creator number of creator and the worth of nft they have so you will have their stat as well number of tokens so you can able to find the native token stats so number of tokens you own number of token your sales contract ico contract own and you can transfer the token to anywhere then we have the auction and here you will monitor all the auction you have created in your marketplace and you can simply go to click here and you can go to the detail page and you can see the details that looks pretty fine now come back here that's the auctions and what else we have we have the transfer all the all the transfer user have done in your marketplace so you can able to see the font they have transferred there and the message they have given they have the feedback so you can see all the feedback you will receive here which user will provide you and complain about it or give any suggestion that's all you'll find here and we have this function where you can simply increase the pricing of listing nft you can withdraw the fund from both the contract so that's how it's going to look and only admin of the contract has the access of this admin panel not not anybody else okay so if i come back here and if i switch my account to account three and if i reload the page you will see i don't have the access so only admin will have the access to this marketplace admin panel so close here and reload the page so that's what it's going to look like so it's absolutely powerful and you can simply click here it's going to open the pop-up model and you can donate the fund from here as well and whatever fund you will donate the user will donate that's going to be received here so let me show you so here we have the charity and that's all you will find here so i believe that you guys have enjoyed this entire demo and now you you will have a complete idea that how this application is going to look like it's really powerful and it is one of the best nft marketplace you can include in your platform so this is really powerful and i hope you guys will get a great idea that how things are coming together and how you can utilize this to build your own marketplace and see you in the course so come back here and make sure to take this course we have a lot of good feedback in this course and a lot of students have already joined it so they are working on this particular course and they are learning every single technology which they have to know to master web3 development so come back here and check the course and let's see you in the course have a wonderful day bye bye